Today we are here in Obertown in Austria in a very cold place full of snow. I'm not very familiar with this kind of weather but I like it so much. It's completely different. Very famous place for snowboarding, ski and also for snow kiting. That's why we're here but right now there's no wind so we're just gonna snowboard and I hope we're gonna find some wind until I stay here because I really want to go snow kiting. It's a lot of fun. Before we keep it up subscribe to my channel Give me a like you can also ask me anything you want uh, if you want to know anything about here on the comments i'm gonna be replying to everyone so let's go down So we just went up in the lift and then Isabel looked down there and she saw two kites. So that means it's windy down there and there are people kiting. So now we're gonna get like few lifts to go over there, pop our kite and go for a snow kite session. Well, let's see, <laughs> try. Yeah, we're gonna try. I only did snow kiting in Norway like two, three times in my life, but I never actually got super good conditions. It was always super light wind. And Isabel never tried, so yeah, it's gonna be fun. Let's see how it's gonna go. Whew. Just got here, the plateau just over there. Brand new Evo SLS, 12 meter. The wind's very light, but this kite flies amazing, light wind, so let's see. So fun, it's a small area, but between the mountains it's pretty epic. So yeah, let's see, let's give him a try. We gotta go first. Isabel is filming behind you. We gotta go later first time. Stuff 
I just finished my session here <laughs> and then I gave my kite to Isabel to go and then the wind died. She only went for like 30 seconds and then the wind died. But it was fun the 30 seconds I went and I can say at least never had having snow kited before. If you know how to kite and if you know how to snowboard I guess then it's totally easy. You can just like I didn't have, even have to think about it so you just go and it's just really hard to go downwind I think like I don't know Rena told me to go like more on toe side and you have to move your body in front that's totally weird and different than kiting but otherwise it's the same you should try <laughs> So between being in the mountains, snowboarding and snow kiting, we are here in Vienna, beautiful Vienna, the capital of Austria, uh, doing some sightseeing. It's a beautiful city. Right now it doesn't even feel that it's winter because yeah, it's not even that cold. Everybody's out, it's strange with COVID. I think everybody just needs to get out of home, get some fresh air and yeah, it's beautiful. All the architecture here from back in the days. It's pretty impressive, it's really cool to see it. ring in Austria right here you can rent so many cars and go to the racetracks off roads you can have so many cool experience you can rent like Porsches Formula 4 buggies Land Rovers off-road everything you can imagine even bikes and motorbikes we're gonna drive a buggy off-road on the snow on the ice I never drove on the ice in my life before so let's get in and see how it's gonna go So that was it for today, <laughs> full experience here on the ice, driving a buggy. It was funny to drift, huh? Yeah. Did you try the handbrake? No. <laughs> I <laughs> did. <laughs> We're leaving the racetrack of the, in the ice and going to the ice mountain, try to find some snow. Calm down before you stress up the groove, the energy a little different when the blessings are So we are back here in Obertown uh, because yesterday Right when I passed my kite to Isabel, the wind died and she could not go. So we are here in the car getting prepared to go snow kiting. The wind actually looks pretty good. There's some clouds coming. And yeah, there's three people out. We're gonna go. I think we only have one board. And one really important thing that you have to do uh, when you go snow kiting, you have to take out the back part of your bindings because then you're not gonna be able to, to edge upwind because your leg's gonna be stuck in the weird position, you know? So you have to take it out the back part of your binding, binding in your calves so you can bend your leg yeah. and you're gonna be able to, to go upwind. It's gonna be way more comfortable as well to ride. Just pump the nine because the wind is pretty good. It's not like yesterday, and today is a much prettier day. Woo! Blue sky, the wind's popping. It's gonna be nice. Yes! Woo! Hard for it. No, I need to beat it for you mess up the mood. Yeah. Ooh, I went too hard for it. And I need it, so please don't mess up the mood. Don't, 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 don't mess up the mood. Don't, 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 don't mess up the mood. Out the kitchen. 
I can make it on whatever you Isabel is ripping. She's going right and left, full power. <laughs> oh my god, it's so much fun. Seriously. Hey, what you need, come on. Just pay the fee, I supply it all. Went up the mountain and it wasn't hard to climb at all. At the top I found some relief, you see, so please don't mess up the moon. Yeah. I went too hard for it. No, I need it, beat it, oh you mess up the moon. Yeah. 